Good morning. Thursday morning, yeah. Let's start do some things, yeah. Fix some things. I was looking on eBay, so it's crazy, like how cheap the <coughs> the activation key for Windows goes. Yeah, this is not a scam, because obviously it's eBay. You have eBay warranty, PayPal warranty. So with two pounds eighty, you can. Uh, have like a genuine Windows, which is great, which is fantastic. I think the price was never so low. Yeah, so let's let me find a laptop. I think yeah, yeah, this one. Okay. So this one, it's a nice Lenovo laptop. Hmm. What is this? Yeah. Yeah. Twenty five. Okay. So we have a job. We have a nice Lenovo laptop. A small one. Listen to me, don't do same mistake like how I did like I think or two or three months ago. So I actually get this laptop to repair and you say let's check it, let's test it. Because you don't have the charger which is it's not like a very common size of the, the, the charger, yeah? And I try to power up the laptop with 19 volts. A lot of smoke in the laptop just go dead. From the simple reason, this laptop doesn't work with 19. So this is... Uh, it's, it's a 5 volts. So you need a 5 volt charger, okay? So let's try, try and find out what's wrong with, uh, with this one, yeah? What do we know? We have the charger. The charger is at 5 volts, 4 amps. I don't think I've seen before a laptop with working with 5 volts, like a normal laptop, not tablet. So let's test the charger. Obviously, that's the first step. Okay, the charger. Five point two, yeah, which is great. So if I plug the charger, I get no light, like charging light or yeah, power, no power line or nothing. What the customer said, yeah, that's what he said. <clears throat> he said he left the, the, the computer on the top of the some heater And actually here we can see it says like a bump So I, I have no idea what we can find inside Yeah. Well, let's open and see So that uh, that laptop which I plugged 19 volts uh, I burned the laptop and actually, it's getting burned like a power uh, a power supply chip. But the laptop was still working on the battery, but not on the charger. So I fixed it. But I just want to tell you, don't do the same mistake like me. Even it's saying on the back 5 volts, 4 amps. This is a Lenovo Lenovo IdeaPad 100S from Sugar. Okay, it's a lot of pressure here. Okay. 
Okay, let's open. Wow. Okay, I was expecting to be like that. Look at the, this battery. So look at this battery. But that's not a reason for this laptop to be not working. So it should be working fine. Even with this kind of battery. Yeah, that's crazy. Okay, let's plug the charger and start testing the things, yeah? Charger is plugged in, let's check the voltage on the charging port. And we have 5.1. Oh, you can't see, sorry. Let me grab the other multimeter. Four point nine, four point eight. Okay, that's not normal. Or maybe it is, I don't know. But I check five point two. Hmm. Strange. To have that kind of uh, power loss over uh, a charging connector, that's weird. And we have charging light, that's crazy, I done nothing. On? No, it's not coming on. Oh yeah, it is on. That's sick, what I did. You think it's a charging port problem? No. The laptop is working, I done nothing, so you know I was opening the laptop with you because of the battery. No. Yeah, that explained the uh, the power loss. That means the battery is charging and obviously the voltage will goes a little bit down because of the wire resistance. Just think this is 5 volts, it's not 19, so the, the what power you lose on the wires is more higher. And it's working fine, I can't believe. i done nothing. So what's the explanation? See, that's, that's a weird case. I'll, can't believe. Yeah, the board is sealed. We have a seal here from Lenovo. What a waste of time. Probably the battery is still good. Yeah, if I unplug the charger, the laptop is still staying on. Charging fine. So just tell me, what was the problem? I done nothing, absolutely nothing. What a waste of time. Okay. What can I say? See you on the next one, yeah? Thank you. Bye.